There are more than 20 different adventures to choose from as an adventure travel guide. Being a tour guide is fun, but if you like to work out and keep fit and find that you do not have time to go to the gym with your busy schedule, why not incorporate a rigorous workout into your job? Becoming an adventure travel guide is the answer. There are a number of different types of adventure travel guide job opportunities, so you do not need to worry about doing something that you might not like or have the skills for. If you feel that you know enough about whitewater rafting, then you are well suited to be a whitewater rafting guide, for example. If you want to start out with something a bit more laid back, then you could opt to become a kayak guide or canoe guide, leading people on river tours. The best thing to do to start with is to look for an adventure tour opportunity or sports tour that you know you have the correct skills and experience for. The responsibilities of an adventure travel guide are not much different to a normal land tour guide, step on tour guide, or shore excursion tour guide. However, with any adventure sport or activity, comes a risk, which means that the tour guide in charge needs to have a good understanding of advanced first aid. You will also need to know about the area you are traveling through and be able to narrate to your group while scaling a mountain or hurtling down rapids. Your job is to entertain your guests, and while you may think that boating down a river is entertaining enough, your tour group will want to know every inch of the area you are in. This means that you will need to learn about the plants, the wildlife, bird life, local cultures and traditions, as well as conservation information if applicable. This type of job is best suited for a person from the local area, but it is not a necessity, as long as geographical knowledge is up to par. The downside of the job is that you will have to be ready for adventure at any time of the day or night, depending on the adventure of course. You will also be required to work in any type of weather, so come rain or shine, you will be outdoors. You will need to make sure that you have all the required equipment. You will need canoes or kayaks, paddles, extra water bottles, enough food, life jackets and safety equipment if you are a river guide, canoe guide, white water rafting guide or kayak guide. One other thing that you have to keep in mind is that your group may not be as experienced at the sport or activity. So you will have to be patient, offer good advice and support, and most importantly keep everyone safe. The trick is to go as slow as the slowest person while still keeping the more advanced travelers well adventured. Lives near to a mountain, a park, or a river, there may be an opportunity for him locally. If he does not mind relocating, then he will have to make sure that he has advanced first aid training good management skills, the ability to foretell dangers, a good knack for knowing the weather of the area, and a proven track record in the adventure of your choice. You will stand a better chance if you can lead more than one type of adventure. Most companies look for guides that are able to do water sports, mountaineering, and skydive for instance. You have to be a person with good communication skills, excellent teaching ability, and a strong sense of humor. You also need to be fit and healthy. Sporting activities, cycling, hiking, horse riding, scuba diving, zip lining, river rafting, paragliding, abseiling, rock climbing and many other sports and activities will give you an edge and lead you to partake in exciting adventure tours. Take your favorite activity and get as much practice as you can.